There's some more pieces I found. I was looking through my dad's stuff. He had these tucked away. These are all mostly, not all, but the Wagner 1891s. I guess when they came out, he went out and bought a bunch of this stuff. Now, it's not really a Wagner, but it's a little T-size corn stick pan. Don't really see too many of these. Here's a little square skillet. I guess you could fry an egg in it. I don't know, I think these might just be more for display, but that's kind of neat. Here's another one, a little skillet, and you know, these are good for frying a single egg. I got a couple other pieces that I use for that, but yeah, I think. I've seen people just hang these on their wall. Here's a little, I guess, Dutch oven. Same thing. Uh, I don't think these have never been used. I think this would be good. Maybe you could put uh, bacon grease in it or clarified butter. Here is another one, and it is not an 1891. It is a regular Wagner. It says 1368 on it. It's kind of neat that it has the lid and a pour spout. And this would be perfect for putting your bacon grease in. You can sit there next to your stove. And if you're ever at somebody's house, and you see they got bacon grease sitting by their stove. That is somebody who knows how to cook there. That is somebody you want to eat at their house if you can. But it's a neat little piece. I'm going to clean this up, by the way. I think I'm going to strip it down and re-season it. Found a few more of these. These wax ladles for home canning. They, just, they need to be cleaned. One of them's an Erie. There's a no name. Uh, I know people. I home can, but I don't use wax. But one thing you can do with these, you can use these for individual muffin pans or uh, popover pans. They work pretty good. You put your leftover batter in there and it, it puffs up nice and it makes a really neat presentation. And here's a another skillet I found. I guess it still has the label on it. And uh, it's, it's all right. It has it's been out in the garage, so it's got a little surface rust, which that'll come off with a little vinegar and an SOS pad, but. I'm probably not going to use it. I'll probably just leave it with the label on it. It's kind of neat. Yeah, it's, they don't do that anymore. But, yeah, well, that's about it.